Okay, welcome back. So this is what uh, in our last video we talked about. Uh, we talked about 1970s when Edgar Cord uh, gave his paper, and this is a groundbreaking paper. And then there are a lot of information there to make a successful commercial database management system. So Edgar's uh, so Cord's paper was first picked up by two uh, University of California Berkeley professors named Eugene Wung and then uh, Michael Stonebreaker. And by 1973 they have delivered a commercial version of software of, of database management system relational database management system based on cords paper and that database known as ingress and uh, they were hiring people from berkeley uh, you know part time students and all those things to to deliver this product and those people who worked with fast version of ingress realized that viability of a commercial successful database product and a lot of people from the initial ingress team they split out and then they started their own version of database which become legendary databases like Sybase, like Informax and Sybase become later on, you know, Microsoft's uh, SQL Server uh, rewrote the exactly copy of Sybase and then that became Microsoft SQL Server. So basically, Microsoft SQL Server is a is something similar to Sybase, something similar to Ingress and Informix, and then another called Nonstop SQL. So these are the different products that came out based on Cord's paper and these databases are, are around um, here nowadays even in 2000, 2012 okay and IBM also started based on uh, Cord's paper a system called System R so System R is a relational database system for IBM and uh, and and they are starting so so based on this thing around 1978 79 uh, Larry Ellison from Oracle came up and then basically read the paper of system R and then Larry started a another person of um, database that is something similar to system R or at least similar to the paper that has that has been in system R and that is how Oracle came up in 1978 and and Oracle uh, you know even though it was the idea came from system R but they became the market leader beating all 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 these things that you are seeing here and that was i think uh, right now even today oracle is probably the one of the most leading database provider okay the database management system provider and so this is how uh, it is started so this is right now and now in 2012 what we are seeing we are seeing oracle version 12 or 11g microsoft system i don't know exactly know what version informix belongs to now ibm also ibm also started ibm db2 i exactly do not know the history how it started but it must be something related to system r so so here we are in 19 you know what we are in 19 2010 or 2012 that we have all this production version of commercial database so it's huge footprint in the industry thank you